Hello to you. Today I'm going to talk a little bit about challenges, about how we go about setting little challenges for our clients to help them achieve their goals, how you can go about adapting that for yourself, but also why challenging yourself and overcoming those challenges is important for your long-term progress as well. See, the thing about health and fitness is ultimately we want to make it as simple as possible. We want to make it as easy as possible but it's not necessarily easy all the time. If it was, we wouldn't be living in the middle of a weight loss, fat loss, obesity crisis. We wouldn't have people who are considerably overweight, unfit, all those things, yeah? So don't make the mistake of easy and simple. We make things simple, but not necessarily easy. That means that you have to challenge yourself to get to where you want to be. If you think about it, what we do as trainers, as coaches, with our clients is set them little challenges every single day that they need to overcome to become a better version of themselves and we map that out for them we keep it at a level that they can achieve but if you think about it we're looking to set them workouts on a regular basis and make sure that they do them we look to make sure that their diet is as on point as we can be and make sure that they achieve them. We want to make sure that their mindset is as good as it possibly can be and how they can go about achieving that good mindset and to be able to overcome whatever challenge it is that they are facing. So if they're incredibly busy, how do they overcome that? If they've got to juggle kids and work, how do they overcome that? If they've got a sweet tooth for chocolate, how do they overcome that? All of these are challenges that we help our clients overcome. So what you need to be thinking about is what challenges do you face in your journey to health and fitness? Is it time? Is it sweet tooth? Is it I don't really know what I'm doing? Is it I hate running? Is it I hate doing press ups? It doesn't matter what those challenges are but one of the best ways that you can go about overcoming them is setting yourself a small goal to take that next step towards overcoming it. So say for example you are currently snacking every single day. Yeah, every single day, you may be taking in 100, 200 calories, something like that in snacks. We wouldn't say cut out the snacks per se, but what we might do is say, actually this week, maybe four out of the seven days, don't snack. There's your challenge for the week, okay? Don't snack on four days out of seven. Do you achieve it? Yes, no. Or say you only snack uh, three days out of seven. Well, yes, you have achieved it, if my maths is correct, yeah? But if you don't achieve it, it doesn't matter. Just reset that goal to something that you can overcome, yeah? And the reason why this is important is that each time you overcome that little challenge, that thing that you think, oh, I can't really do that, your brain recognises this, it sends you signals saying, well done you, and it means that the next time that you approach a challenge, you are that little bit more able to overcome it, that little bit more likely to succeed at achieving that challenge. So every time you set yourself something and overcome it, your brain will reward you and allow you to achieve your next challenge even easier. And if you don't achieve it, it's not a problem. Maybe it just meant that that challenge, that bar was a little bit too high to achieve. So just set it a little bit lower, jump over it and move on to the next one. So you have to challenge yourself. You have to set yourself up to make long-term progress by challenging where you are now, decide where you want to be, and setting those challenges in place. Do that, overcome those challenges one step at a time, and you will achieve success. That is essentially how we work with our clients, how we get them achieving success. It'd be great to know what challenges you set yourself. Drop a little comment below with what they are. Most importantly, how you are going to go about or how you have overcome them. Look forward to reading them. We'll see you soon.